January 1st, 2017. First day of the new year. Of course, I didn't see the new year come in because I was sound asleep at 10 o'clock, as is typical for me. I like to celebrate my new year by getting up early and getting a fresh start. So I got my uh, workout in, got all stretched out. Now I'm heading to uh, Campbell Lake for a trail run. Getting all ready for football. It's a Seahawks game today against the 49ers. I think we're going to win, but the Seahawks have been a disappointment this year. I love them. They're my team, but uh, they sure have had their ups and downs. A lot of injury. So 2017, what about resolutions? Well, I'm not a big one uh, for resolutions. You know, it is a good day to uh, think about, you know, it is a kind of a fresh start, at least mentally. But I don't really have any resolutions per se, but I do have ongoing goals. A few years ago, I decided that, and I'm generally a positive person, but I really wanted to take it to the next level. I wanted to be that guy. We all know that guy that when you meet with them, talk with them, you'll walk away and for some reason, you just feel better. They make you feel good. Can't really put your finger on it. You just enjoy being with them. I, I want to be that guy and I'm trying hard to be that guy and I've been working on it a couple of years. I do a couple of things, kind of mechanical things, but they're true, they're heartfelt. And that is when I meet with somebody I want to talk about them. I want to talk about their family, their work, their hobbies, their interests, and really listen. I don't need to talk about myself. I know about myself. I want to know about them. And having an interest in people, it does make them feel good. I also want to find something good in everybody. And, I, and it's possible. If I can't find something good in somebody, it's my failure, not theirs. No matter who they are, you can find something good to point out, something good to say, and build on that rather than focus on the negatives. And that's a big part of this is I'm sort of looking away from all the negatives. They're easy to find. Whereas in human nature, it seems we're very good at picking apart other people. And I have just have put that behind me. I want to look for the good stuff. Now, I'm not always successful. You know, it's like going on a diet. You know, you do really good and then you blow it. But you don't just quit. You just start again. You just pick up where you left off. And so I'm going to continue to, to work on that, to find the good in people and say good things. And additionally, I look for and have been looking for and will even look for more opportunities to do something nice for other people. And this doesn't need to be big, grandiose things. I'm talking about the little everyday things that are easy. Holding a door open, giving up my seat, um, slowing down in traffic, flashing my lights, letting somebody merge in, waving when I'm driving, smiling, just, and smiling, that's a big one. I'm really wanting to smile. I, I smile a lot, but I want to smile all the time. So that's what I'm going to continue to do to be positive. And, and I carry that through in everything, you know, from the people I meet. And that's another thing. My, I guess if I do have a new resolution that I'm adding to this, I want to meet more people. And when I'm traveling, it's easy, but even around home, when I see somebody, I just, you know, take a minute, say hi, just get to meet them. You know, it doesn't have to be, you know, the great new friend, just taking a minute, somebody you don't know, and just, you know, saying hi and holding the door and just having a little interaction, having time for other people. I'm a very busy person and I know that sometimes I can get really wrapped up into that. So, you know, that's, uh, that's my goal. So that's uh, nothing grandiose. I have a lot of things with YouTube. I, I want to shoot a lot more video. I want to do more vlogging. I want to do more of my educational woodworking and photography videos. Those are all great and I will work at those things. Um, ton, tons of other little things. I'm, I, I love having a million things to do. And another one is learn something new. That's not new for me. That's not a new resolution. 
I am interested in learning new stuff, whether it's about something that I'm already doing, a skill that I have that I want to improve on, or whether it is uh, learning something that I'm never going to use in my personal life, but just expanding my knowledge. My Christmas present this year from my wife was a Bluetooth headset made by Bose. And I'm pretty excited about this. I've used them a couple of times. As a runner, a person who exercises, I like to listen to my books on tape, to my podcast, and occasionally to music. And I've always done it with the wired set. And so I wanted to try out the Bluetooth. And, you know, getting earphones that fit in my ears uh, when I'm sitting at the computer is one thing. But when I'm out and working out and being active, it's something different. And I've never really had a set that fit really good except for those nice earbuds that go in you push in and but they're all wired but I wanted to be wireless and so last year my wife bought me a set of Beats uh, their sports version of their Bluetooth and I've used these for a year and I've got them working pretty good they sound great um, and they have these you know parts that go over and hang on your ear and so they never fall off but I could never even though I tried all the different um, mounts that they come with the little parts that go in your ear you know they even though they won't fall off my ear they they tend to be a little bit loose now I've you know bent and shifted these and I've got them to sort of hold themselves against the back of my ear so they work pretty good um, overall and I probably wouldn't have replaced them but I mention it once in a while and my wife logs it away in her memory banks and so when she's looking for something to get for me she digs in there and she came up with another set so i was totally surprised i had mentioned these i had looked at them in a store and couldn't obviously try them out but the reviews said that they were you know as far as staying your ear they one of the best ones so you know the the left one stays in really well and they're soft and comfortable this right one I've, it tends to be a little bit loose so um, this is the way they came out of the box and they have other mounts or, or other ear plugs I guess you call them I don't know what you call them the little parts that go in your ear and so there's different sizes so I think I'll you know test out those and see what I can get but so far you know first couple of days out they are my favorite they they stick out a little big in the ear but and I thought that boy that would be have a lot of weight and uh, I don't know maybe fall out but they definitely don't fall out and they're they're comfortable not having the piece over my ear is kind of nice so I'm pretty sure this is what I'm gonna go with boy those change easy well this right one definitely I can tell the difference I put the large one in I must have big ear canals All right, well that was a good run. Got the heart rate up, feeling good. The uh, headphones worked really well, they didn't move, but of course I was wearing a cap, so I can't really give them 100% yet. I'll have to wait till warmer weather. What an absolutely beautiful first day of 2017. So now I'm gonna head home, finish up my workout, get a nice hot shower, get ready for some Seahawks. Well, come along with me this year and find somebody to be nice to. Let's have a great year.